Hey guys, Mike here at MS Tutorials, and welcome to part one of the uh, video series on the modeling toolkit in my 2016. All right, this has been asked uh, quite a lot, so let's get started. All right, now first of all, the modeling toolkit can be found up here in this corner. You have this little icon, it looks kind of like a, a hammer next to a cube, and when you hit that, you get this menu that pops up, all right? Okay, so in this video, we're going to talk about the quad draw tool. So we're just going to select that. Now, what happens after you select that and you left click on your grid? You're just going to get a number of green points. Okay, doesn't look very useful, does it? Okay, well, it works slightly different. I'm going to hit Control Z to go back. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create four points. One here, one here, one here, and one here. Now, it's called the quad draw tool for a reason. Uh, I now have four corners, if you will. So if I hover my mouse in between these four and I hold down my shift key, this pops up. When I left click on it, I now have a face. So let's say I want to extend on this. Let's say I want to create a face row. I can click to here, to here, to here, and what I'll just do to show you that you can kind of tweak that. I'm going to put some variance in the distance and so forth. All right. So let's say we got all that. Okay. I'm going to hold down shift. I'm going to go over this area, click on it, click on it, click on it, click on it, click, click, and click, and hit enter. Now, this is uh, one more actually, sorry. This is ideal when you need to uh, model uh, fairly complex shapes based on an uh, image that you've loaded. And after you've done all this, if you just hit Q on your keyboard, right click and go to object mode, and you select that and you, for example, go to edit mesh and extrude, and pull up the thickness, you just have a polygon object as usual, right? So that's all there's to it. That's the Quadra tool. Thank you guys for watching and love to see you guys next time.